Hello everyone and welcome to a another semi-permanent hair dyeing video. So I'm super excited because I've been wanting to try this brand for a while, but we finally got her. So she comes in a bunch of different colors. I know you can't really tell because my hair looks jet black, but we have like a little bit of color to work with in the front pieces. That's basically where it's going to be seen. I am not going to attempt to bleach all my hair for this because A, it's semi-permanent, and B, the reason why I cut my hair to begin with was because I was like, my hair at one point felt like straight up like straw. Like, because I bleached it so often. So, yeah. She needs a, a bit of a break. Okay, so let's see here. This is the Color Cloud Demi Permanent Foaming Hair Dye. I thought purple would be fun. Thought I was getting an email. So this is a cool dusty lilac hair color that washes out in four to six weeks. I don't know if you pronounce this Hallie. Hallie's Color Cloud takes the guess, the mess, and the stress out of at-home hair dye. Infused with natural nourishing extracts, Color Cloud is a demi-permanent hair dye that lasts four to six weeks. It doesn't have any ammonia, sulfate, parabens, PPD. It's gluten-free and it's cruelty-free, but it has aloe, ginseng, lavender, and chamomile. I don't know if I've ever heard of those items being used in hair dye. Section the hair into three parts for easy application. Pour the shade into the pump bottle and give it a two second shake. And then put on your gloves, pump the foam into your hands and fully lather into dry hair. Hop in the shower and condition like normal. Don't you have to wait for this? It doesn't look like there's a... It's definitely different than what I'm used to. Okay, so this is what the color looks like. I'm so excited to use this. This would be so fun. Okay. These are the gloves. Um, I will have this kit linked in my description if you want to check it out. Like I said, there's a ton of different colors available. The one that I got was the purple avalanche. So this is leak, leak no more. I swear you have to put this on for a certain amount of time. Okay, yeah. 30 minutes. Cool. All right, so. Wait. Oh, yeah. I gotta remove this. I don't really have nails, so. You know what that like thing reminds me of? It almost reminds me, well, this reminds me of soap, but this reminds me of those weird like ink things that like you get at bingo. That makes me sound old. I don't actively play bingo, but I did um, volunteer in an old folks home and they were into bingo. Okay, so put that in, shake it up. The look of that looks like straight olive oil. That was throwing me off. Okay. Let me go ahead and see the results. Okay, so let's do the review of the hair. Um, also, I'll have a code in my description on where I get my um, stuff from Kitsch. I have a discount code where you can save some money. Kitsch is literally my favorite hair brand. Their hair accessories I live by. So I truthfully don't think it did shit for my hair. Like, okay, yeah, it looks a little bit darker. Yeah, like if you squint your eyes like enough, you can kind of see purple. But yeah, I mean like these parts 
kind of look like it, but didn't really do a whole lot except make it darker. So should I have probably bleached these parts? Absolutely. Do I really, really like the concept and wish 100% it worked? Also, yes. Um, but yeah, that is going to do it for the video. Have a great day, guys. And yeah, it probably would look great if I bleached my hair, but you live and you learn.